Today we're going to show you how to set up asynchronous remote replication between two Eon Store DS systems. First, you're going to need a source and a target system. A partition was created on the source system. You don't need a partition for the target system beforehand, but do need a logical drive. You'll also need a data host. Click on the Remote Replication Manager tab. Click on Network Diagnostic Tool. You should see the source and target systems. Click Next. Set the number of diagnostic packets you wish to send and click on the Diagnose tab. The diagnostic process may take time depending on your network conditions. Click Close when done. Click on the Create Replication Pair tab. Choose the existing volume option. Select the source system and click Next. Select the target system and click Next. On the Configure Replication Pair page, users get a choice between Volume Mirror and Volume Copy. With Volume Copy, users can set a schedule with date and time and operation priority when to copy the volume. But today's demonstration is Asynchronous Mirror, so choose the Volume Mirror option. Select Asynchronous Mirror. Click Next when done. A summary of the created replication pair will appear. Click Previous to modify settings or OK to proceed with replication pair creation. Pair creation may take time depending on various factors. A window will appear upon completion. In the Replication Manager, you should see the Replication Pair status as Asyncing. Close the Replication Manager. Under your Source Device, go to the Schedules tab and click on Create Schedule. Select Volume Mirror and click Next. The volume mirror pair just created should appear. Tick the box to select it. Click on Next. On this page, users get to set the date and time, so choose a schedule that is best for you. Click Next when done. A summary of the schedule will appear. A completion window will appear. Click Close when done. The asynchronous mirror pair schedule should appear in the schedule list. The asynchronous mirror pair is ready to go.